How's it going everybody? It's Kevin here once again giving you another gameplay commentary. Today we're talking about some potential Halo news for E3 2018 this year. If you like these kind of news and speculative kind of videos, please make sure to tap that like button. Let me know you want to see more content like this. It greatly helps that the video gets more notoriety. Subscribe for more awesome Halo content. Leave a comment down below how legitimate you think this information is. And we'll catch you uh, at the end of the video here and we'll figure it out. So as you may know, E3 is coming up this year in June, so it's very close around the corner, so there's probably some leaks and speculations going to be coming out right here, and there's been some information, some rumblings here and there about some games coming out this year, such as like a Borderlands 3 rumored to be coming out, a new Splinter Cell game, potentially a new uh, Perfect Dark game called Joanna Dark, which I'd be super excited about that because I love that game, one of my all-time favorites. Some more information on Cyberpunk 2077 which does look very interesting i do love the theme of that game as well and of course your typical maddens or minecraft new battle game which has been kind of referenced as well a bunch of times as well but the big thing that i saw in here as me being a huge halo fan this being a halo channel is that there was halo was referenced in this saying calling the game halo genesis and they're talking about it's going to be a reboot it's going to have split screen it's going to be on a new engine, Warzone 2.0, a multiplayer beta coming out in 2018, and a teaser for the release of it in 2019. Now this, to me, makes a lot of sense. Uh, because one, Halo Genesis, it makes sense for that title because Genesis was actually a, uh, I believe it was a planet, or at least a, something like that, or structure, or something like that, uh, that was featured in Halo 5 for like a... For a, couple, for a few levels actually and so it was a very prominent uh, place for the Halo 5 campaign to take place on so it would make sense that this game would be called Halo Genesis now they say it's a reboot now I'm not quite sure exactly what they mean by a reboot when they're calling it Genesis do they mean as a reboot of the gameplay rebooting of the story and just toss down everything Halo 5 talked about or is it going to be kind of bringing back the classic gameplay of Halo with possibly a new version of Warzone? I mean, it's, it's all speculation at this point. Like I said, all, there's nothing, uh, nothing's been, uh, nothing at all has been mentioned about the Halo, new Halo game coming out uh, in either 2018 or 2019. So many times these leaks just before a game's release can be very true. I remember back when I was covering Mass Effect, back when I was calling it Mass Effect 4 information back then, there was a leak of this survey that was released talking about all the things that they were questioning in the survey and things like that. And I was like, no, oh, no, it can't be. But they said the game's placed in Andromeda. It can't be placed in Andromeda. That's so far away. Humans can't get there. But ends up, and that ended up being Mass Effect Andromeda and pretty much everything in that survey was true. And that was released, oh gosh, must have been like a year before the release of that game. And so... Right about now is probably when you have some finalization happening with Halo, because my guess is that there won't be a new Halo coming out this year. Maybe that's probably why they're rebooting or revamping Halo MCC to be kind of like a filler for the uh, the new Halo 6 game that will be coming out. My guess would be 2019. And of course, a beta around the fall this year would be an absolute perfect time for that to happen. It's the same thing that happened when uh, MCC dropped. They had a beta for Halo 5 a year before its release as well. So this would totally fall in line with what uh, Halo was going to do. Plus, Bonnie Ross mentioned that for sure we'll be doing betas every time a new game comes out. We will for sure have split screen. My guess is they probably have to do a new engine if they really want to make it 1080p, 60 FPS, and still have it work well on the old X original Xbox Ones. Now I will link the website that mentioned this. It was on 4chan and it was on a thread here, so I can link that in the description down below if you want to check that out. And uh, so you can kind of read for yourself. I mean, it's all, it's just literally just states game, what they're doing, year. And that's it. So you're not a whole lot of extra stuff to read into on that information. But yeah, potentially Halo Genesis. I'm excited about that. That sounds rather interesting. What would you guys like to see in Halo Genesis? I know all of you have opinions on where Halo should go. Everyone on YouTube seems to have a, their own opinion of where Halo should go. But uh, I'll definitely read all the comments. I do read all of them and try to reply to most of them as well. Uh, I will be making a probably a top five list of top five things that Halo Genesis, potentially Halo 6, must do for it to kind of maintain 
it, the feel of it being a Halo game. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to tap that like button. Like I said, it really, really helps out the channel and this video get some more notoriety. Now, spread the word of Halo Genesis. Maybe it's a real thing. Maybe it's not. Maybe just talking. We'll see. And <laughs> leave a comment what you would like to see in the next Halo game, guys. And if you're always new, you can always tap that subscribe button because, well, we're always uploading awesomeness to this channel. And it's always Halo. Always good times. So thank you so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace out.